The perilous journeys of the Star Trek crew continue. It's been 20 years since William Shatner as James T. Kirk first walked onto the set of the Enterprise. He remembers. The set was very strange to us. Uh, we were in essentially a circle with a raised platform behind. And every, they were pile, they were made of, up of pie-like sections that could be separated so we could shoot, get a camera in and shoot it. Pit group furniture or something. <laughs> it really was. <laughs> and so how it all worked and what to do and where to walk and what, it was all very strange and new and different. Not to mention the costumes. And the cost, yeah, I mean, you couldn't go out for lunch. Otherwise lunch would show in the, in the costumes. <laughs> so it was all very nervous making. Now, coming on the set in these films, we know how the set works, we know what to do, we know how to, and, um, and uh, <laughs> don't know about lunch. Who are you? Who do you think I am? Don't tell me. You're from space. No, I'm from, I only work in outer space. For me in the well, aging process, is not only as an I mean, actor, but as a human being, I begin to realize that we don't know anything. We don't know anything. Uh, we make a few discoveries in science, like, how a molecule works, but even then we're not quite sure. <laughs> but where that molecule leads us to is opens up another mystery. Maybe uh, in 300 years from now, uh, when Star Trek's supposed to take place, we'll know more. I mean, if we knew how the universe operates, would we know everything? I'll tell you what, after 20 years, you may know less, but we know more about <laughs> how much we enjoy Star Trek. Oh, well, that's wonderful. Star Trek 4 from Los Angeles for KCTV 5. I'm John Tibbetts.